Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have a Patreon poll pick, and that is the movie Sister Act. This was based on, I think the genre was heartwarming comedy. And that's about all I know about this movie. <laughs> is a heartwarming comedy and Sister Act. So obviously this is something to do with a uh, family with sisters um, and how they act against each other, maybe? That's my guess. Is it some type of family comedy with a couple of sisters who act out, maybe? Maybe they act out? I don't know. The uh, make sure you check out my second channel, and that is Awesome Shows. You can look for that on YouTube. It's one word, Awesome Shows. And uh, what else? There's lots going on in the background. How much I should tell you? I don't know. Website development going on right now. Merch in the process of testing. There's lots going on with awesome U.S. movies and awesome shows. If you don't know who I am, uh, my name is James. I'm an ex-farmer who grew up in the middle of nowhere and only had three channels on my TV, so I just didn't watch it. And I became a massive bookworm and have been for over 30 years. And so uh, I cared more about books than movies. And my oldest children convinced me to start this channel and start catching up on all these awesome U.S. movies. So welcome to the channel. Make sure you subscribe and like, of course. And let's watch Sister Act. Touchstone. St. Anna's Academy. Who can oh, the that kind of sister. Whoops. George and Ringo. Dolores Wilson, you are the most unruly, disobedient girl in this school. Write the names of all the apostles alphabetically. Oh, goodness. He's got swagger. Peter and Elvis. I wash my hands of you. Have you any idea what girls like you become? Oh, it's Whoopi. I know her from Ghost. She can't get her mic off. Oh, she's a lounge singer? <laughs> a sister act. Look at the size of the hair. <laughs> they haven't heard that lyric in that song before. The one with the mustache, the one you're married to. Oh, I know that guy. He's from uh, Pulp Fiction. He's the like uh, the cleanup guy. I can't remember. The wolf, I think his name was. I want us to be an honest, decent couple. I went to confession today. I told Father Antonelli I was in love. Oh. And what did he say? He said that if I got divorced, I'd burn in hell for all eternity. Oh, yeah. No, no, just not now. Just get out, okay? Just go. He's not happy. You're quitting just because he won't leave his wife. What's gonna happen to the act? I mean, what's gonna happen to the act? You're gonna get somebody else. It's not a big loss. What do you want? Hey, uh, the loss, yes, from Vince. What he said. I don't want them in here. Get out. Let's go. Let's look and see what it is. Oh, yeah, it's a it's purple, purple mint, fur. Oh, she's thinking about it. it. Might convince her a little bit. Well, obviously, Mr. LaRocca feels he can win me back by sending me this fabulous couple. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I'm going to make him wait a little while before I just let him know that I... It's his wife's coat. Oh! Wow. I think it's time to just go upstairs and give it back to him. Get the hell out of this dump. Ernie, you know what's important to me? Loyalty, uh, my man. A loyalty, oh, sure. I hear you went down to the police station last night and talked with Lieutenant Salter. I, I, I went. Oh! I went. Are we dealing with these type of people? Ah, it's a Goodbye, silencer. Vince. Goodbye, Vince. I'm going to Miami. I know. Security just let her right up. What were you doing there for three hours, Ernie? And I'm going to leave you. I'm going to Chicago. Oh, now she, she was going to go to Miami before. Now it's Chicago. <laughs> Is she going to walk in on this? Yeah, she walked in on it. Dolores, is there a problem with the coat? 
What's <laughs> no, not with the coat. The coat's fine. It's fine. Thank you. Thank you. Is the way you came here tonight to thank me? Yeah. About tonight and the things you said. You understand me? Forgotten. Mm hmm. Yep. Got it. <laughs> Run, Dolores. Vince, she seemed kind of upset. Bring her back now for talk. Take care of it. Oh, yeah, time to go. Run. Oh, yeah, oh, cool. That's one way to win. Keep going up in the world. That's weird. It connects to the outside. Yeah, put your guns away, dummies. And then Vince looks at Ernie and says, say goodnight. I mean, he just shot him in the chair. Just boom, he blew this guy away. You're Vince LaRocca's girlfriend, right? It depends on how you look he, at it. Oh, I mean, the yeah. The just tried to kill me, so I don't think that cements our relationship. Well, you realize he's a major underworld figure, don't you? No. We've got videotapes. We've got surveillance. Am I in any of the, uh, the videotapes? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're safe now, and we're going to see that you stay there. If you testify against Vince about what you saw, we can put him away for the rest of his life. Do you know what's going to happen? He's going to track Dolores, me down. He's going to. We wouldn't put you at risk if we couldn't protect you. Right. Oh, huh, sure. Just a couple of months. If you testify, I'm going to put you in the last place on earth that Vince would ever look for you. They're going to make her into a nun, sister act. They're going to make her into a nun. Oh Lord. I want you to stay here for a while. You know what? I'm gonna go back and work this out with Vince. You're a lunatic. These people don't even have sex. <laughs> nope, they don't. I promise I'm gonna spring you as fast as I can. What am I gonna do here? Pray. You pray. Oh. I'm sure there's a more appropriate place. We can save this. Oh my god, it's McGonagall! <laughs> They've promised to make a generous financial donation. And as you know, your small convent is in danger of closing. Oh. Excuse me. Yeah. Huh? Well, think of it this way, Reverend Mother. She's an ideal prospect for rehabilitation. That is a rehabilitation. You have taken a vow of hospitality to all in need. I lied. <laughs> ha. Oh, that's a sin. What is your name? Dolores Van Cartier. I I've always admired you people. You people. You're so. Catholic, you know. Oh, so Catholic. Miss Van Cartier, we have agreed to conceal and protect you. However, it is essential that you understand that you are not in a sorority. Oh. This is a convent. You're right. And there are certain rules you must obey, and I will not tolerate any disruption whatsoever with that communion. Oh my God, she's McGonagall. It's the same person. It's almost lunchtime. I certainly want to change. Yeah, you have to be a nun. Open the cabinet to your left. You will find suitable attire. Ah! Oh, no. No, no, no. I can't. Ah, she's a nun. People wish to kill you. Anyone who's met you, I imagine. Oh, jeez. While you are here, you will conduct yourself as a nun. Until you leave, you are Sister Mary Clarence. Oh, Sister Mary Clarence. There are three vows every nun must accept. The vow of poverty, mm -hmm. the vow of obedience, mm -hmm. and the vow of chastity. I am out of here with that. Yeah, boop, boop. Chastity? Chastity as in chastity belt, by the way. I'd like you to welcome a new member to our house. Oh. Hi. Would you like to be seated? Thank you. Boop. Yes, Mary Patrick. I'd like to offer a great big hi there and hello to Sister Mary Clarence. Boy, she's spunky. I thought that maybe our new sister could offer today's blessing. I could do that, uh, sure. Bless us, O oh Lord, for these thy gifts which we're about to receive. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of no food, <laughs> I will fear no hunger. <laughs> you to give us no. this day our daily bread. <laughs> Trespasses. By the power invested in me, I announce us ready to eat. Invested me. <laughs> no, that was awesome. <laughs> what is it? Beans? It's not good. Oh, we shall spend the rest of the day in silence. Oh. And you have to eat this food. Silence begins now. <laughs> it ends at sundown. I think you might enjoy a ritual fast. Let me pass me the salt over there. A fast. 
uh -huh. to remind you of those who must endure without food. Yeah, you don't need to eat. I want you to take my yes, plate. <laughs> and silence. <laughs> ah, these two are gonna battle, aren't they? Oh, what a nice garden! That's a, yeah, big tomato. You gonna steal the tomato? <clears throat> She's watching you. Ooh, do they have pockets? See you in court. You got nothing on me, Salta. If you don't stop harassing me, I'm gonna... What? You're gonna what? Yeah, right. What are you gonna do? Something's going on. He's so damn cocky. Yeah, I... he should keep his mouth shut. Find Dolores. She's gone. He's got Dolores. Facts are eight by ten to every contact we got. I can't hear this. Uh, Dolores Van Cartier, a quarter of a mil, dead or alive. Quarter of a million now. This is your cell, Mary Clarence. Cell. No wonder you waited till now to spring this on me. Where's the rest of the furniture? Our lives are simple. We have little yes. need for material possessions. Exactly. What do we do now? Pray what? It's nine o'clock. Pleasant dreams. Wait, wait, are you telling me we go to bed by nine? Uh-huh. Before I came here, I had a career, I had friends, I had clothing that fit. From what I've heard, your singing career was almost non-existent, and your married lover wants you dead. She knows the truth! God's watching out for you, Mary Clarence. I think, oh my God, look at this neighborhood. Mary Clarence? Up and down, we don't want to be late. What time is it? It's almost five, sister sleepyhead. <laughs> almost five?! Come on, the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. The sun ain't up. It's five o'clock in the morning. We are a small congregation this morning. One, two, three. Still, rather than four, regret the absence. About 25 people. I was thinking, oh, the piano's out of tune. Oh, that was pretty good. Oh, wow. She's got a big voice. <laughs> the one girl is overpowering all of them. Great on a pawn shop in LA this morning. Dead or alive. We miss her so dead or alive. Yeah. So where'd you stash her, Eddie? You're not even gonna tell us? I wouldn't even tell the Pope. Oh, that was a clue. I'm not gonna get this. Don't you worry, you'll get the hang of it. I'll help you. Are you always this cheerful? She's so sweet. I can't help it. I've always been upbeat. So oh, what did you oh, come from? the cheery one is from Hocus Pocus. She's one of the witches, right? You're a pioneering kind of order. Never wear any kind of habit this tight, though. This is really tight. A progressive convent? Sounds awful. I like my convent in Vancouver, out in the oh. woods. Wasn't all Ooh. modern like some of these newfangled convents. We didn't have electricity. Cold water, bare feet. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Those were it was nuns. On Earth. I loved it. Ah. This place is a Hilton. <laughs> you don't know how hard it is to get a call until you've worked in Reno. Newlyweds, hookers. How fulfilling to be able to get right in there with your hands and work with the people. And Reno is probably bursting with sin. It was, yeah. Sure. We had a hooker living next door called Buckwheat Bertha. Sister Mary Clarence, could I have a word with you? Yeah. <laughs> don't want to hear about the hooker. Oh, she's cleaning all the metal. Uh oh. What? She's washing the car. Yeah, I need to talk to Eddie Souther. No! Dolores, you can't call me here. Somebody's going to catch on to where you are. Look, I didn't want to tell you this, but we got some problems here. Uh -huh. Keeping our witnesses alive. I mean, we hide them, but there's a leak in the department, and some of them end up dead. What? What? Oh. Just sit tight. Yeah. I am in a nightmare. I mean it. Don't call me. It's not safe. Hello? Uh-huh. He doesn't care about your problems. So it's like a little flower. My brother gave it to me when I was a little girl. I could never seem to get up on time, so I um, set it for five. Oh, it's a little alarm clock. It's the shape of a flower. Out of bed, you daisy head. It always made me laugh. Being away from your convent that even someone like you could get lonely. Of course. Do you always want to be a nun? Hmm. I've always felt that there's something inside me that I, I want to give. Does that sound like a terrible thing? It sounds like a terrible thing at all. I'm so happy that you've come to join us, Mary Clarence. So why doesn't she wear an outfit like that? It's less, you know, tight. Loud. Uh-oh, uh-oh, what are we doing? 
Oh, another one. She's following her. You don't see that every day. A nun walks into a bar. Young man, take your foot down off that oh. stool. Now have a seat. Have a seat. <laughs> Took care of that situation. Oh, here comes the other nun. Where's the third one? Oh, there's a third one. I just want to tell me what you're doing here. Well, I, I thought that you might be ministering to the winos. The winos. What are you doing here? I'm here to see a man about a car. Oh, with two bucks. Money does. All right. It'll come back to you tenfold. Thanks. It'll come back to you tenfold. Oh, I love the song. Wow, they got some old songs on this kind of bar. One dance. I'll be right back, please. <laughs> She's running. <laughs> She's having some fun. We have a lovely time. We'll be back. Yes, we will. Goodbye. We have a lovely time. We'll be back. This turns into a nun's bar. I'm out of it. <laughs> a nun's bar. Oh. Listen, they just don't want to be stuck behind these walls. These robes no longer protect our sisters. The walls do. I disagree with her. Oh, no, come on, don't send me away, really. There's got to be something around here that I can do that's not going to chip my nails or annoy anybody. Oh, the choir! Restrict your activities to a single task. Singing. Yeah! Uh, the choir? I mean, uh, have you heard them? She's hoping she can help them. Is this a choir rehearsal? Sure is. Soprano or alto? Whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness. Reverend Mother says Mary Clarence has a background in music. Were you a choir mistress? Sort of freelance. Oh. You think I took vows yesterday? You're a ringer. She brought oh. you here to replace me. I'll yeah, you're a ringer. Mary Lazarus, you're terrific, but we could really use some help. Please, you've heard us. We're terrible. <laughs> yeah, they are terrible. There's a word for this. Mutiny. Yeah, mutiny. Make them sing. A challenge. She knows what she's doing, probably. <sighs> Where are the bases? Just want you join them. Oh, you've got to come down this way. Yeah, you got to split them up. Bases, I, I want you to give me a D. Altos, give me an F sharp. Oh, she knows what she's doing. Sister, will you give me those uh, notes, please? <laughs> Sister Mary Robert, I noticed that uh, you're moving your mouth, but nothing's coming out. So uh oh. Sister Alma, could you give me an A, please? Check your battery. Give me an A, please. There you go. <laughs> we call that an A with an attitude. And it's not just quacking. This is this is rejoicing. Hallelujah. Very nice. The next thing you have to learn how to do is listen to each other. I knew that. <laughs> Man, listen to them. They really need a lot of work. Oh, please, let us try. This is going to be hell. Tell me about it. Yeah. <laughs> She's going to be able to fix them. The choir, I'm told, has elected a new director, Sister Mary Clarence, mm -hmm. who will lead them in Hail Holy Queen. Okay, here we go. Hail Holy Queen. Oh, so much better. No oh, look at that, boss. Very good. Oh. oh we got a little spunk in it now. Sounds great. Ooh, a little boogie woogie in there. That's right. Music will bring them in. Oh. Wow, she can sing. What a fun song! I ah, see even the boys are liking it. Oh, that voice of hers, man! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> they did a great job. She's not happy. Just a reminder that I'm offering a seven-day free trial to new Patreons. That is where you can find all my full reactions and this exclusive content. Boogie woogie on the piano, what were you thinking? And what next? This is not a theater or a casino. People like going to theaters and they like going to casinos, but they don't oh. like coming to church. Why? Because it's a drag. Pack this joint. Through blasphemy?
me? It's not blasphemous. Thank you. As of tomorrow, Mary Lazarus resumes her leadership of the choir. I haven't enjoyed Mass this much in years. What? Oh! I can't wait till next Sunday when the choir performs again. That heavenly music, Reverend Mother, it called to them. <laughs> this is something she would never tell you herself. She wants us to go out into the neighborhood and meet the people. <gasps> oh! -ho! Threw that then there! Anything you can do to revitalize this neighborhood would be a blessing. Don't you just love her? <laughs> <laughs> We're getting out in the neighborhood. Churches are a lot more than just a religious institution. Oh, nuns in front of the adult bookstore? I'm sure they don't like that. This is so fun. Oh, money's going in the till. Where'd the beetle come from? Oh! They're getting it going! Oh. <laughs> Sprung a leak! Double dutch! Good job! I can't do that. Can you do that? Oh, they got graffiti artists helping over there! Are we getting some more butts in the seats? Yeah, we are! There we go! 50s, 20s, yay! We bought our goal! She has to be happy about that! What an amazing turnaround story. This, now as you can see, its doors are open. In Minnie, get over here. Oh, no. Homeless. Oh, no, she's on as TV. As a matter of fact, the sister Mary Clarence. Little camera shot. Oh, he's not going to be happy. How come I saw you on TV? You're supposed to be hiding out. I can't talk about it now because I have a show in five minutes. This is not a career opportunity. You don't have to tell me that this would not be the place to begin a career. No. <laughs> you going to come to the show? Yeah. They need some color in that church. Miss yeah, there we go. Inspired by the lesson. Mary Magdalene was a young... Look at that gorgeous church. Listen to the girl's story. Well, we have a story. Carry me away from my God. My God. Instead of... <laughs> instead of my guy. I'm telling you from the start. Do they know the song, though? Could make me oh. true. <laughs> This is so fun! Comes to being happy. We are Oh <laughs> Yay! Look at how many people are there! So why does the one nun have a completely different outfit than the rest of them? I can't wait till Sunday when we sing. <laughs> I'd rather sing than do anything. Better than springtime. Better than sex. <laughs> Oh. No, I, I've heard, you know. What I'm about to say is nothing short of a miracle. The Pope himself has heard of our choir here at... Really? He's requested a special concert here on Sunday night. In San Francisco? Glorious news, almost. I do feel a traditional program would be best. Your more secular entertainments would be totally mm -hmm. out of place. Well, maybe that's what he wants to see. It's brought people back to the church. And that's why yeah. he's coming. I feel this can be settled by a simple vote. Now, all those in favor of performing a program of time-honored spiritual repertoire. Oh, she's going to lose. All those in favor of allowing Mary Clarence. Raise your hands. The majority has spoken. I'm sure the presentation will be a great success. Oh, she, she feels spited. She feels like she's losing them. You have a phone call. What? Judge agreed to move up the trial. We'll be in court in a couple days. She doesn't want it now. Oh, it's, it's great. Hey, well, don't thank me or anything. It's it. Thank you. Bye. Well, she's not going to be there for the Pope now. You're leaving? Yeah. That makes two of us. What? I have submitted my resignation to Monsignor O'Hara. Why? I must go where I can be of use. Look, everything that's happening here is it's a good thing. You are a formidable woman. You can a keep million this percent. going. I feel I am a relic. Good day, Mary Clarence. Oh, I feel bad for her. Ta -da! <laughs> it's ice cream. It's a great big cuddly bear hug of a thank you from us to you. It's a cuddly bear hug. That's a wicked indulgence. Didn't they have any butter pecan? Yeah. <laughs> Since you've come, everything has just happened. Anything could happen. I mean, any one of us could be transferred out of here at any given time. Are you uh -oh. leaving us? What are you talking about? No, we're always going to be together. No, she's speaking out of the side of her mouth. I need a signature on some things. This... I'll make sure he signs it when he comes in. Well... 
convent. Ten thousand dollars. He's a bad guy. We found them. And Tate said to leave the money vouchers with him. Uh huh. Whoa! Uh, here's our leak, boys. Plug him up. Well, what proof do you have? <laughs> Where's Dolores? I sent it up. They know she's here. Oh, but I can't go. We're, we're singing for the Pope. Listen, tomorrow. you're gonna be singing for St. Peter if you don't get your ass out of here now. Oh, no. She's gonna miss the concert. I can't do this. I can't leave. They need me. They need you. Yeah. We are talking about the Pope. This means a great deal yeah. to them, and they have worked very hard for this. Where are you going? I'm going to the little nun's room. How are you gonna hide out in the church? And out the back door. Let's go. Surprise. Oh no! They found her already! There you go, 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 go! She got picked up! You just go with the flow, okay? Oh, go, go! Oh, good, she got her out. They're guns! Where are they taking them? Oh, they set the moonlight loud. Why would anyone kidnap a nun? Were they Catholics? Ah! She isn't a nun. She witnessed a vicious crime and has been hiding in our convent. Mm -hmm. She was such a wonderful nun. Well, I don't care who she is. We can't sing without her. I know that you and Mary Clarence didn't always agree, but we've got to help. We can't leave it up to the feds. No, yeah. <laughs> Mary Manuel, tell the Monsignor the situation. Yes, mother. The rest of you, follow yes, me. Mother. Where are you going to go? But, but we don't have $1,500. Well, then I can't fly you there. I'm sorry. I've got some things I have a to check out. A lot of nuns. Father, do not blame this young pilot for abandoning us in our hour. Oh, God. Just because he can't show charity to nuns, try not to leave him without rewards. When <laughs> Guilt trip central. Hold on a second. We're taking a helicopter? To Reno. What did you think you were doing running to the cops, Dolores? Bet you're sorry now. I'm sorry for all my sins, Vance. Oh, goodness. We're a... I'm done now. How do you repay me? What's the thanks I get? You'll be judged. We all will. Wow. It's like uh, she's getting nothing. Uh huh. It's done. Uh, not totally. You can't waste a nun. She's a yeah. She's a nun. No, she didn't join up and become a real nun when she was there. Things like this happen. Because I know this woman in the biblical sense, and oh, she yes. ain't no nun. Right. Just don't come back till it's over. Are okay, they gonna be able to do one, it? One, two, three, shoot. One. Oh, it's gonna be loud. Two, three. Shooting, shoot. <laughs> and nobody's yeah, shooting. Come on, girls. One dollar slot. Certified loose. <laughs> come on, come on. Take off the uh, nun thing. Yeah. I want you to forgive Willie and Joey. They're only doing what Vince told them to do because Vince is too chicken to do it himself. Guilt trip him. Um. Oh! Go, go, Dolores, run! Oh, jeez! Yeah, there aren't some witnesses there at all. Go, go find this. Right. Yeah, you don't see that every day. Brace yourself, sisters. Try to blend in. Yeah, sure. Blend, blend in. Sure. Place your bets. Yeah, 23. Mm -hmm. How do you know? Sure. Yeah, look at them all go. It ain't gonna be red 23, no way. Yeah. I was just trying to teach you all a lesson. <laughs> you lost all your money, suckers! Oh, he's there already? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Woo! Found her! Good luck finding her now, boys! You go to the right, I'm gonna go down the middle. There's nuns everywhere! Yes, sweetheart. Uh-huh. Yeah, <laughs> not her for sure. Off the exits and get ready to move in. Oh, they're all going out the same way. Move in now. Will hit the lights? Oh no, they're Freeze. all stuck in there. Calm down. Joey. <laughs> he doesn't want to do it. She's still a nun. I guarantee you she is no broad. Ooh, sticking up for her. It's a model of generosity, virtue, and love. Aren't you glad we didn't shoot her? Yeah, exactly. Oh! Ooh! The gun's down. The gun's down. Wow, right. that right. was... Right. That scared me. I thought he'd shot her. Boy, am I glad you're a much better shot than you are protector. Thank you. Uh-huh. Right, uh, you are nothing! Get him out of here. Yeah, whatever, guy. Bless you. No. Let's go. Come on. Oh. 
I hold you responsible for all of this and exposing us all to mortal danger. Thank you. Wow! She won a theater. We're gonna miss you guys. <laughs> Sisters, we have a concert to do. I thought you were leaving. We can't both of us leave. Good. She's gonna stay. She keeps mixing these old songs and with church. Oh, there we go. There's a good outfit for her. Yeah, there's the Pope. <laughs> she is so good. Oh, the Pope's. <laughs> Yay! Way to go, Dolores! And the Pope is standing ovation! Oh, the Dungeon! Heaven, heaven help me! <laughs> she met with the Pope? Rocking the church! None of that! <laughs> Rolling Stone! Out of the convent, onto the charts! <laughs> oh, listen, sis, they did make a record! Place orders, operators are standing by. The Fitzgerald Group, Fitzgerald's Hotel and Casino, St. Paul's Church in San Francisco, City of San Francisco, City of Reno. So they were at the actual church, of course. I mean, like, you can't reproduce that. I'm just watching the rest of the credits. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about it. That was Sister Act, and it was the Patreon pick for heartwarming comedy. And boy, did they get that one right. It was so good. <laughs> I didn't just enjoy the movie. I really enjoyed the music aspect of it. I really did. It was like a little musical built into a heartwarming comedy. I loved Whoopi. I've only seen her in Ghost. So it was nice to see her in this more, I don't know. Would you call this comedic? I'm a little bit, maybe. A little comedic role. But it was just so fun. And all the different nuns. And so why did the one nun with the crazy good voice have a completely different outfit compared to all the other nuns? Please tell me, explain that. I don't understand that. Because I'm not Catholic. So I know all the songs and I know the you know hymns and everything just because I go to church. But... I'm not Catholic. They use the same kind of hymns. Um, but yeah, I wrote a great pick by the Patreon members. Way to go, everybody. It was so fun and good. Yeah, I haven't seen a movie like this before. It's just... <laughs> I, I watched all the credits. I never do that. Unless it's like, what do you call it? MCU and I have to watch the credits because there's always something at the end, right? But I just was enjoying the music, so I just watched all the credits. It was so fun. Man, I hope you enjoyed this reaction. Like and subscribe. Don't forget about my second channel, Awesome Shows. There's links below. And, uh, yeah, thanks to my Patreon members. They did such a good job on this one. I really did love it. So thank you to all of you. And, of course, never forget that you are awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye.